All right, in this video, we're going to show you how to adjust um, our adjustable nozzles. Here we've got one in a just traditional pop-up. This is the soft top that has the softer cap that can be used in sort of play areas for children so they don't injure themselves if they happen to fall on the sprinkler or anything like that. But um, So the way to do that is you would get your, your tool here for pop-ups. Um, you can just insert that on the top, pull it up, and then it clamps on the bottom and will hold the nozzle up so you can make any adjustments. So if you look here at the nozzle, there's, there's a few things you need to look at. Um, here on the bottom, on the yellow part, you'll see a small tab, and there's one likewise on the black part on the top. Now when you turn this clockwise, as far as it'll go, those two will connect. That indicates that the nozzle is completely closed, so the pattern is at zero degrees right now. Um, now when you turn it counterclockwise, that is opening the pattern up. So this is the leading edge here on the top part on the black. As I open it, and I'm at this point, we've now got a quarter pattern. So everything between here and here will spray water. If I turned it again, I could get a half pattern. So that's 180 degrees spraying in this direction. All the way will give me a 360 degree spray pattern. So the way you can tell that is by those two tabs. You can also look at this small dot that's on the top of the nozzle. That indicates where the leading right edge will be. In this case, my right side over here. And then another adjustment you can do is you can adjust the actual spray distance a couple feet. Um, the way you can tell what kind of nozzle you have to begin with is on the top. It will have some indications. Right here it says Pro 4A. That indicates it's a professional nozzle. The 4 indicates the standard spray distance, which in this case is four feet, and the A stands for adjustable. So this small flathead screw on the top, if I turn this counterclockwise, it will open it so that I can get a, a couple more feet extra spray, and I can go actually count, counterclock, or sorry, clockwise, and that will close it down. So um, usually you're going to only get, even in your best pressure situations, you're only going to be able to get max one or two feet extra spray distance or be able to stop it down that much. After that point, you really need to step up to a higher um, distance nozzle. And we make those all the way from four feet to 20 feet, so you should be able to find the one that fits perfectly. But that's how you adjust those. If you have any questions, please let us know in the comments below. Thanks.